Peace, you powerful ass manifestors. It is I, your favorite prophetess. <laughs> prophetess Asha. Alhamdulillah. 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 Fucking law. Okay. <clears throat> God is fucking amazing. Because what, bitch? Because not just because we find divine ones, because we are. We woke up fine again this morning. It's getting out of hand, okay? It done got out of hand. But anyway, y'all, spirit, and this came out in our live in today. Um, And if you are on TikTok, we are having this, we're calling it the breakthrough, where we break down um, uh, verses, uh, scriptures from the Bible. Um, we're going to have verses from um, all different kind of spiritual texts. We'll be learning about mudras. We'll learn about chakras, meditation. So y'all come Sundays, 3 p.m. Eastern. Okay, it's going to be for an hour. It's called the breakthrough. But anywho, so Spirit literally said today that you were always called the black sheep, but you, you really were the saving grace of your family. So you may have been the black sheep of your family. Okay, that's the title that we have attached to ourselves but we really were the saving grace okay our grandparents great grandparents our ancestors they manifested us they knew that we will be skilled as fuck and we are this came out the other day too about us being their prayers answered and our children and children's children are going to be the answers to our prayers so let's see what <clears throat> spirit has out here uh, for the collective today. So stop calling yourself the black sheep because you were never the black sheep. You were always the saving grace, beloved. Okay. So spirit, what is the message that is for the <coughs> our divine collective today? <coughs> to help them see, help them know their purpose, help them understand their worth, why they were really sent here to be the saving grace. Look, watchers, some of y'all are meant here to, some of y'all were sent here and meant to sit back and observe and watch and study these humans. <laughs> these low vibrational energies, not just humans, the low vibrational energies, the entities, okay, the principalities to call them out, okay, to identify them. <clears throat> All right, so we as a divine collective can begin to hold our energy back from the ones who don't deserve it because, bitch, we are the saving grace and we're only saving people who want to be saved. Ooh, ooh, period. Because what? Look, as I say that, that defeatist, that defeatist attitude, okay, you, we, I came here to defeat, defeat the enemy, okay, and some of them are within our own family, all right, so they should be grateful for you because you came here to save them, okay, to save their wayward ways, is what Spirit just said, okay, so some of y'all, um, a lot of y'all are being celebrated, your ancestors are celebrating you right now because you are the gift that keeps on giving, is what I just heard, mm period. Okay, so you came here thinking that you were the back black sheep. You were misunderstood, ostracized, and it's because you were always the light. You were always the blessing. Okay, people fear things that they don't understand, and you have been an anomaly since birth. Okay, but you came here to be <clears throat> people's saving grace. That's why you're so sweet. That's why you offer people grace. You know, like I said, your family should be thankful. As I sit here and say this, okay, you came here to change the way that close cycles, you came here to change the world. Look, with your intuition, your knowing, your wisdom, spirit said, because you choose to align with the divine. You choose this energy, all right? It's a lot of people that make choices and <clears throat> they can have good hearts and they allow life to life their ass to the point where it makes their heart um, dark, okay? They have a hole in their fucking soul, all right? But... When they come, when they come to you, okay, you be people saving grace. It be them who fumble the bag. A lot of these people have a cured uh, uh, um, karma, okay, have a cured this debt, this karma, okay, since they were little. And so when they got to you, the saving grace, they had a chance for the slate to be white, type, clean type shit, right? But. <laughs> I just saw the nine of uh, the nine of swords, <laughs> but they're all in their head. So now, because you were the strength, you are the strength of your family. You were never the black sheep. Okay, look, look, look at this. Look, 
You were never the black sheep, okay? This is why they fought you so bad because their hearts are dark and yours was always light, all right? You always carried the strength within your bones. Like I said, the, that, that force that your ancestors always prayed for, that was you, okay? So self-discovering, you are now discovering um, and on a new journey uh, to find your strength, to understand these karmic cycles, to understand that you belong on the fucking top, beloved, that you are a lender and never a borrower, is what Spirit just said. So continue to have this connection with the Most High, all right? Continue to have that connection with your higher self, with you, all right? And now <clears throat> you're going to be attracting other light beings who understand that you're the saving grace because they are as well, all right? So you are always the blessing walking that shit. Y'all go forth with the power of source behind you. Continue to dare to be different. Dare to dream your destiny and stay the fuck aligned, divine, and fine, y'all. Peace.